How's it going everyone? Welcome to the Foodie TV. It's Davian and Richard. And today we're in Garden Grove, California looking for something to cool us down on this very, very hot day. It's 90 degrees, it's super hot, so we're looking for something to cool us down right away. And lucky for us, we found Young Juice. And it's all coming right up in this video. Let's go. Time to cool down. down. All right, guys, so we got our sugar cane juice right here. I got a strawberry sugar cane. And I got the dragon fruit sugar cane. Right, let's try it out. All right, you know what time it is, guys. Time to cool down like we just said, so let's go. Oh my gosh. Okay, dragon fruit and sugar cane, I thought it would just be so overpowering by the sugar cane because of the sweetness, but you actually taste all of the flavor of the dragon fruit in here, which is so amazing, refreshing, and it cooled me down right away. All right, guys, and over here, I got the strawberry sugar cane again. Let's take a sip. Wow. Dude, that strawberry flavor comes right through. The freshness of it, you can tell they use fresh strawberries. And the ratio of strawberry to sugar cane is amazing. You, you really taste it, super refreshing. Wow. If you like strawberries, this is the one to pick. The sugar cane juice in here is so good. Usually when you get sugar cane, it can be a little too sweet or too bland, but the sugar content in here, they pick the right one. Right. And again, with dragon fruit, there can be bad dragon fruit and there can be very good dragon fruit. And I'm so happy that we got the good dragon fruit one. And the thing Amazing. I like about the strawberry one is the strawberry adds a little acidity to it. So it cuts through the sweetness of the sugar cane. So, it's just right, wow. nice and refreshing. This is our first time ever trying these fusions of sugar cane with different types of fruit, but we have a very big surprise for you that I bet you never even heard of. But first, we got some snacks. This place sells fresh fruits. They also sell uh, snacks as well. Yeah. So right here, we got some homemade Vietnamese beef jerky. Oh man, and it looks super good. We got some roasted lotus heats. Every time uh, you go here, he says he sells this out all the time. So if you guys see this, go ahead and pick one up and give it yeah, a try. It looks like this is imported from Vietnam. It is imported yeah, from Vietnam. Because like the, the backside labels is all Vietnamese. It's and all Vietnamese instructions. Yeah. So you know it's legit and it's imported straight from all right, guys. Vietnam. All right, but let's go ahead and try this beef jerky. Yeah, let's try these beef jerky. I love beef jerky, yeah. so I'm super excited about this. So this was also uh, made in Vietnam and uh, brought over here is what he told us. So. We're gonna go ahead and give this a try. And, right. ooh, oh, it's look nice at that. Tender. Oh man. It's not dry. There's some chilies, yeah. chili flakes in there. Right. Okay. Ready? Cheers. Cheers. Oh yeah. Mm. It's not dry, which, you know, just beef jerky is a dry snack, but this one has a little bit more sugar, so it's not too uh, chewy when you tear into it. Lots of flavor. Yeah, you guys never had Vietnamese beef jerky before? It's, it's a blend of a lot of spices. You got some curry powder. I believe there's some spice spice in there. Mm -hmm. And it's just a smoky curry flavor to flavor it. To it. Yeah. It's like amazing. There's sweetness to it. There's saltiness to it. Yeah. And then just a little bit of spiciness to the Yeah, jerky. to me, it tastes like a curry that is sweet teriyaki almost to me, uh, which it's really good, mm -hmm. to be honest. And then they have chili thick in there, so it gives it just the right amount of kick. All right, let's move on to our next snack. The roasted lotus seeds. He says this one sells a lot. It's very popular. So I'm excited to try it because lotus seed. Oh, this is really cool looking. Whoa, whoa. Check it out. So this is a broken piece, of course, but that's what it looks like on the inside, dried lotus seed this chips. This is what it looks like when it's not broken. There you, you go. This reminds me of the uh, Mexican chip snacks that you get with the oh, chili yeah, and those, stuff like those that. Oh yeah, those little willies. Yeah. All right, let's try it out. Here you go. Mmm. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> okay. You guys hear that crunch? Oh man, these chips are good. <laughs> I can see why this is a fan favorite. It almost reminds me of banana chips, but it's not as sweet and doesn't have a banana flavor, but it's very close. Really like it. It's pretty and good. There's just a slight hint of sweetness to it. So, it makes it like a really good sweet snack, yeah. but not like anything like sugar 
loaded candy and things like that. Yeah, you won't feel guilty eating this. Um, it feels a lot more healthy to me um, during these snacks, and it's also a really good side to go with your treats. But I think, Richard, <laughs> you know what? What's up? I think we need to do just a pure ASMR. Pure ASMR, okay. Bite for the audience. You guys ready to hear the that crunch? crunch is like no other. I gotta pick up my mic for this. Okay. Right. Ready? You guys aren't ready for this, okay? Here we go. Cheers. There you guys go. That's a nice, <laughs> crunchy, crispy chip. Okay. All right, That's guys. It for the snacks, let's jump into that special drink that we promised you guys. I'm gonna let Dave in. Introduce All right. it. They, they, they have something here on the menu that when we heard about it, we were like, oh my gosh, we've never seen it or heard of it before. So we had to come. And here it is. Boom. This is a durian sugarcane juice. Have you ever heard of durian in a sugarcane juice? I'm pretty sure you have. <laughs> so we're here to try it out and let you know how it is. Not a lot of people like durian. You guys have probably heard of all of the horrible smell stories that uh, you know people tell you about. But if you're Vietnamese, we think it's delicious. Yeah. So well, here we are with the durian sugar cane. And we're gonna give it a try and give you our honest opinion. All right, guys. First time. First I love time. durian, so I'm excited. Here we go. Cheers. Cheers. Wow. My knees are buckling because it's so good. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> this is so good. You see how we broke character for a second and became like oh, little girls man. that are so happy because we got like a new doll or something? That's what's the feeling I got when I drink this. The flavor of the durian comes through right off the bat, right off the initial taste yes. and sip. And oh man. But the cool thing about it is like durian, if you know it, it has a lot of uh, fibrous uh, mm -hmm. texture to it. They strain it all out so there's no pulp, there's no yep. fiber tendons in there. It's nice, clean juice. Yeah, the and that durian, it just hits so good. It's not stinky. Super good. It's yeah, everything is sweet. Very smooth, very yeah. clean. And the sugar cane mixed with it tops it right off. Yeah, the, the fragrance wow. of the durian is not too much. So if it's your first time ever having durian, it might not be so bad. Yeah, why not be so bad? This would be a good way to introduce yourself to durian if you're first time uh, trying it. Because if you have probably durian by itself, it might be too pungent for mm -hmm. you. But this was a good way to cut that down and it made it very enjoyable. It's really good. I think I usually get the sugar cane with coconut and coconut meat on top. But I think this is my top favorite now. It's almost Ooh. like a durian smoothie, but in juice form. Like, that's how I can explain it. It's just, it's just, everything's right about it. So good. So, so good. amazing. So, all right. You know what time it is. What time is it? Which one is your favorite? <laughs> Easy. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Just because Dude. I've never had this um, 32 years of my life, never tried anything like this. So, this was my first time, and surprisingly, it is a hit. Definitely 10 out of 10. And again, guys, I think this is the only place that I know of that has it. So, and, oh yeah, the owner did say that this is, he sells a lot of this, so yeah. it's very, very popular. Yeah, so this is uh, the sister shop to Coco Cane. If you guys been to Coco Cane, they sell all of the same drinks, but there's three drinks that they don't sell at Coco Cane that they have at Young Juice. And, and it's the three that we tried today. And it's the strawberry cane, the dragon fruit cane, and the cane with durian. And I gotta just say, every single one of them was a hit. Ooh, super refreshing. Guys, if it's a hot day, we recommend coming here. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you on the next episode of, of the, the Foodie TV. TV. Peace. Peace.